Now, you experienced a little bit of drama mm -hmm. during the season. Just a touch. <laughs> so there was a lot of focus on your relationship with Hannah B, who mm -hmm. is current Bachelorette, because you two knew each other from the pageant world. Right. So where do things stand with you and Hannah now? Um, <laughs> Best question. Um, we are like just supportive of one another. Oh. We're not, I, I never like think girls have to force friendships. You know, not everyone's gonna get along. There's 30 women, not all of us got along and Hannah and I are, are an example of that, but we can support one another without tearing each other down now. So we're in like a very good space and she's killing it as a bachelorette. So I'm very happy for it. That's so sweet. I mean, it's true. Not all women are going to be friends, right. but I love that you're supporting her. Yeah. And she, yeah, you're watching her season. Yeah, she's killing it. I'm watching her and I'm like, there's no way I could do this. Like, she's doing such a good job. Well, a lot of people thought you were going to be the Bachelorette. So, no. <laughs> were you open to that opportunity? I mean, I'm open to like finding love and falling in love, but I just don't know if that space is for me, like to find love in that space. It would have been great. It would have been a great experience, but I would not have done as good of a job as Hannah's doing. Okay, there was also a little bit of drama with some of the girls who thought that you and Cassie were not there for the right reasons. Mm -hmm. So, do you have any regrets from your time on the show? Um, I have one regret, and that is calling Tasha. Tasha's amazing, wonderful, lovely, love her. I was just very heated in that moment, and and your you know emotions are high, tensions are high, yeah, and, of and I I you know regret the choice of words that I used in that moment. Mm. Well, I appreciate too that you're being open about that and that you kind of take accountability for your yeah, actions absolutely. rather than saying, yeah, you know, it didn't really matter because that wasn't you in your best moment, right? No, absolutely. Yeah, yeah. The, you know, my best sides got shown on The yeah. Bachelor, but also my worst sides and sides that I didn't even know I had in me got shown and it's just because it's such a weird environment and, and that's why I've taken this time since, you know, November um, to work on myself and I'm truly the happiest I've ever been in my entire life. I love that. Well, yeah, it's a very emotional situation that no one can really understand unless they go through it, it's, right? It's hard to empathize and, and you know, until you're in it. Yeah, I've, I've been a fan of the show since Ali Fedotowski and really? <laughs> I started watching it Ali's season. I'm obsessed with her. Yes. Yeah. And I was always, you know, I hate to say, but judgmental towards the contestants and then you mm -hmm. go through it and you're like, Oh, okay. Yeah. I get it. <laughs> yeah, you have a new perspective. Yeah. So, okay, Katie Morden was here last week. Yes. And she wants to squash whatever <laughs> beef is remaining between you two. Are you open to that? Oh my gosh, absolutely. I, I, there's just, there's no reason right? for there to be any sort because of Because she's beef. lovely, you're lovely. Yeah. And so, okay, so Katie, if you're watching, <laughs> Katie. I told her that I was, gonna, I was gonna make some peace between you two because yeah, I mean, you guys are both cool. Yeah, so there's no reason. I love this. Okay, great, we're all gonna be friends now. <laughs> I'm really happy to hear that. Kaylin, are you going to be on Bachelor in Paradise this summer? Um, maybe. Maybe. That's if the I'm first single. maybe I've gotten, Kaylin. Mostly I get an I don't know, probably not. A maybe. Is I mean, I'm open exciting. to the idea if I'm single and if I'm, you know, but what if I like leave here today and meet my husband? Okay, if you do, then I'm happy <laughs> for you. I really am, <laughs> genuinely. But okay, right now you're single. Right now I'm single. Paradise so starts I'm filming in it. about a month. Mm. Chances are we're gonna see you there. Maybe. Right? Maybe. Okay, so let's just talk hypothetically. If, <laughs> if you end up in Paradise, which guys from Bachelor Nation do you have your eyes on? Okay, so. Oh, we have um, a list, we have a list, I'm excited. <laughs> I like Garrett, I like Garrett. Connor S. Yes. Um, Jed, Tyler C. Um, Pilot Pete, there's a lot of good ones. Kaylin, okay. this is exciting, right? Because before the season started, it was pretty much just Blake. I know. As, as the option. Blake and Dean. And is Dean going, maybe? Do maybe. We know? I okay. Don't know. Okay. I met him in person and I was like, whoa. Okay, what was the whole thing about Dean and the <laughs> sliding into his DMs <laughs> from. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, I, I wasn't going to ask, no, but no. at the Women Tell All, what was that about? So Dean was like traveling Asia and I had just traveled Asia, so I like slid in and said something funny. And. Then we were gonna get coffee, and um, it just like didn't work out. And but how did all the other girls know met? about that? Because uh, Onyeka was like, she was in Japan, and she DM'd him the same time I did. And she's like, oh my gosh, I'm in uh, Japan, so they were gonna meet up, didn't work out. And Onyeka was like, yeah, I slid into Dean's DMs, and it was funny. And um, and I was like, okay, I wasn't gonna say anything, but I did too. And I was like unashamed, and yeah. I had never met Colton, so like, what is the big deal? And yeah, it was in Thailand, and yes, everyone's like. Emotions are heightened, but we're not serious all day, every day. Like, 
we're usually laughing, we're having fun. And so for people to like take that and just be like, she's not taking this seriously. I was like, oh no. We're all laughing and having fun and hanging out by the pool and yeah. you know. No, I, and also, I mean, that happens all the time. People communicate with other people from The Bachelor right. before the, they go on the show. Right. So, well, okay, Dean, if he ends up in paradise, you got a lot of options here. I think you're gonna be in I a love just, triangle, I was like, whoa, Kaylin. whoa, whoa, there's more than I thought. Kaylin, these guys are gonna go crazy for you. <gasps> oh, Is this gonna so. be a good summer for you? You could be engaged by the end of this I summer. I am hoping. <laughs> I, so the next time I see you, that you would be might have wild. a fiance, Kaylin. I'm going to have to switch up my ring game if oh. I get in the engagement. Oh, it's perfect. Your nails are already done. You're yes. ready to go. Okay, so out of all of those guys, who is like, I, I feel like Connor fits the Liam Hemsworth type, the closest. Yeah. Do you agree? Yeah. Yeah? Hopefully he's Connor, funny. if you're watching this right now. Connor, <laughs> let's hope you're funny. <laughs> I think I think I can sense he's not boring for sure. Yeah, yeah. There's, I mean, we're gonna see more, but I think that he might. I think he might be your guy. I'm calling it now. Ooh. Calling it now. One more extra. Hit the subscribe button and the bell. Never miss a video.